McCaw tries the back cut, taken away by Shackle up the floor. The lob for Todd as he flushes it home. And that's what we're accustomed to seeing right there. Goodwin, a little hesitation. Kicks it, Shackle in the corner, no hesitation from him. Ends up in the hands of Goodwin, he puts it up and in. Goodwin works off Monroe. And that's a solid shot right there by Goodwin. Being unselfish, a lot of big guys will put their heads down once they start to go into their move and not be aware of where their teammates are. But the bigs for the go-go are very good at that. Monroe, a little hesitation, the kick. Extra one, Schuler. Drops it to the big man. And that's just unselfish basketball. Holland in the paint. Taken away up the floor. Schuler with runway as he throws it home. And Schuler very athletic and able to finish over the top. It's getting done on the defensive end for the Capital City Go-Go. Powell blocked by Echenique. And the big fellas continue to man the paint right now. Gets the two. Harrison gets right to the hoop as he lays it up in. Echenique. Turns, faces, back cut from Schuler as he lays it up Excellent in. Excellent pass right there from Echenique. Cross court, Harrison. Even with the outstretched arm of Isaiah Todd, still knocks it down. Only six turnovers. Yeah, I mean, those are recent. You know, they played a significant portion of the game with no turnovers. McCaw in transition off the turnover. They're going to be a tough out for anybody. They'll go just two for nine from the three. That's Todd, another one in transition. And that's a great throw down right there by Isaiah Todd. Powell. And Megan, we've been talking about the Go-Go's defense and how they've utilized it to get scoring. That's just a great pass right there from Jordan Shackle and even looking, acting like he was not involved in the play. You see the steal right there from Jordan Goodwin. And the finish, and it's really been about the Go-Go's defense right here, Megan. Defense, Tony, staying active. The Go-Go getting it done on the defensive end, and as a result, they have gone up 15. A couple of threes here and there. I mean, the Go-Go have really done a good job defensively. Monroe. Ayayi. Shackle got baseline just as the shot clock expires. Great find by Joel Ayayi. Pons kicks it. McCaw three, so two threes to start the third quarter for Delaware as they've cut it down to 15. Pons in the paint. That one doesn't go. Shackle with the loose ball up the floor. Ayayi to Goodwin. That's a good fast break right there. A good 2 on one Great decision by Joel Ayayi to give that ball up. Gather right there for Echenique, just taking his time, making sure he's on balance. McCaw in the paint, goes to Bassey. All Jordan Goodwin could do is just try and stand as tall as possible. Ayayi. Echenique is left alone as he hooks it home. It's kind of like a hook flush. Yeah, a little bit of a hook flush. That's that in between. Should I dunk it? Should I lay it up? <laughs> McCaw. Spins, hangs. Count the bucket and the foul. Patrick McCaw going to go to the free throw line. McCaw, 20 points now in this ball game. Ayayi in the paint. Left it short. Tried to get his own. I don't know if they'll give that to We'll wait to see if they give that to Echenique or Ayayi. Yeah, but that one is. Good offensive board by Joel Ayayi. That pass from Mane taken away by Goodwin. Count the bucket and the foul as Jordan Goodwin will head to the free throw line. Goodwin rises in and out. Loose ball, Shackle comes up with it. Then Ayayi to Goodwin for the lay -in. Excellent interior passing right there. Mane down low, lost the handle, but collects it back. Five on the shot clock. He goes baseline, up and under. Very acrobatic move. Very acrobatic move right there. Nah, that's a tough position to be in when you get your finger bent out of joint. A lot for Sword as he lays it up. Like that good pass from Greg Monroe. How? Four seconds. 
attacking, hangs in the air, gets that to fall, 1.9 left. Play a lot of guys to see who's in a good rhythm at this point in the season and how well they blend. Shackle in the corner as he connects. And that'll be a guy that we know will be seeing playing a lot during the playoffs. And they've gotten a pretty solid contribution off the bench as well. And another 29 points from the bench. Winston in transition. Walker somehow still got that to fall. Still got the finish. In the fourth, time not on their side. Harrison with the steal. That does help their offensive output. Sword got all the way behind everyone. Sword, Sword showing you the type of bounce he has. No dribble. Ponce in the paint. They're going to give him continuation and send him to the free throw line for the three-point play. Ponce gets the three-point play. And Henry running the floor defensively comes up with the steal. Here he is now in transition. Lays it up and in. Okay. Mike Williams has seen enough. And whatever Patrick McCall had on the tip of his thumb has come off and is in the middle of the floor. <laughs> Todd to Ayayi. There you go. No. I, have, I have no doubt in him. You, you can't jinx guys like that. And John. Oh, my. Okay. Strong finish. His ability to not need to warm up. Yeah, well, that goes in line with youth. Uh, while I'm going to give him credit for that. McCaw to Ponce. Chipping away are the Blue Coats. Jaime with the assist. He could potentially be their second best defender behind Craig Sword. Enjai, another dunk for him after the triple team. At one apiece. They will improve to 18 and 8. Delaware will move to 18 and 9. Comment, like, and subscribe at NBA G League on YouTube for more.